In today's video, we're going to talk about the perfumes I am super excited to wear for fall. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Diafne. If you're new here, welcome. Bienvenue, and thank you for clicking on today's video. As you can see by the title today, we're going to talk about the perfumes that I am super excited to start wearing during this fall season. Now fall is my favorite season. As you can see, fall colors and full effect, I am ready. So I'm going to share with you, I think I have about 10 perfumes here that I love to rotate during fall. And first up is Oriental Tobacco. As you guys can see, I have been going ham on this one. I could not even wait for fall to start wearing this. This one is my absolute favorite. It is inspired by Tom Ford Tobacco Vanilla, Tobacco Vanille. You guys, this one is definitely my favorite. This one is like fall in a bottle. Out of all of these combined, like if I had to pick just one, this would be it. The top notes are tobacco, ginger, and apricot. Middle notes of honey, vanilla, and cocoa. Base notes are tonka bean, dry fruits, and blonde woods. I'm pretty sure I talked about this before in one of my previous perfume videos, but this one is definitely, it's like woody and then a nice vanilla dry down. I absolutely love this one. Keep in mind, most of these perfumes I'm going to show you are more in the warm, vanilla, woodsy kind of family. These are pretty strong, heavy hitters. They know you're coming, you know what I'm saying? Like, boom, I'm here, you smell me, and yes, okay? This is, these are the kind of perfumes I'm talking about. If you're familiar with my channel, you know two things for sure. One, we love to talk about perfumes over here. And two, we love Dossier. So just in case you're unfamiliar, Dossier is a inspired by luxury fragrance brand. So they take the notes from your favorite luxury products, well, luxury fragrances. Now they have candles as well, you guys. So definitely check them out but they take the notes from your favorite luxury fragrances and they give you an affordable version. And we love that. I will have everything linked down below for you guys. I will also have a coupon code. The second one I have here is Fougère Oud. And this one is definitely inspired by Tom Ford Oud Wood. Now, this one is definitely a heavy hitter. This one is very much masculine. This one is the type of perfume or cologne that I would definitely pair with something a little softer just to soften it up a little bit, but I absolutely love it. It is very warm. It is woodsy. It is strong. It is like I'm here. It is fall. I absolutely love this one. The top notes are rosewood, tobacco, pink, pepper, coriander. Middle notes of oud, patchouli, vetiver. Base notes are tonka bean, labdanum, and cedarwood. I love it, but like I said, it leans a little more masculine. But I love the dry down on this one. The next one I have here is Le Labo the Noir 29. And this one, again, is a definite hardcore, woodsy, masculine, warm, vanilla-ish, tonka bean, tobacco family. It is very strong. I can't even dare wear it in the summer or spring. It is definitely a fall and winter scent because it is that strong. It is very strong. You don't need a lot. Um, you don't need a lot at all. And I love to pair this one with my Woody Cinderwood. This one is from Dossier, but it is inspired by Le Labo Santal 33. This one is just on the fresher side than the Santal 33. So I like to pair the Noir 29 with this Woody Cinderwood. 
and I absolutely love the pairing of these two. This one just soften it up just a little bit. You still get that depth and the warmth that you want during fall. Now keep in mind you guys, like I said before, if you do not like heavy scents, strong scents, these ones that I'm talking about right now are not for you. I'm gonna move on to softer scents in just a little bit. You might like those just a little more. The next one I have is definitely a little softer. This one is Tom Ford Metallic. This bottle is absolutely gorgeous. It is a silver and gold bottle. I absolutely love this one. I prefer to wear this during fall, winter season. You get that warmth from this one but you also get a little freshness it's not all death it still have like a little lightness to it which i love it is definitely a scent that i've never smelled before it smells like leather almost you're wearing a leather jacket you are maybe on a motorcycle or maybe in a car with your windows down driving early morning and you're getting that whiff of that nice morning wind this is what this remind me of it's warm but it's still light if that makes sense so this is my next one i have five more to show you guys some of them i'm going to show you together because i like to mix them but of course you can wear them separately but it's just my preference the next one that I'm going to talk about is Chanel Coco Noir. Now this perfume right here is my absolute favorite. It's always in my collection, you guys. You don't need this much, okay? You don't need to spray this much. This one is definitely RBE, baby, okay? This is rich woman energy. They know you're coming in. I love, I love, 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 love this. This one demands attention. Like when you're wearing this, it gives you confidence you have to be confident you have to wear this like okay i'm the boss i'm walking in you see me you know what i'm saying this is this perfume right here i like to soften it up a little bit with the chanel ovive or the otanga because they're just a little softer and they're very lightweight so i would definitely if this is too strong for you i like to mix it with something that's more lightweight which give it a more feminine like softer feeling but this perfume on its own i absolutely love to wear this during date nights Ugh, during the fall oh my gosh i love all my fall perfumes like these perfumes for sure like i just i love the next one i'm going to talk about is one that i've talked about here on my channel before for sure and this is replica jazz club i know you've heard about this on other channels other people love 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 this one this one is supposed to replicate a location so this one would be like a jazz club and it really really reminds you of that when you smell it i love this scent and it says it is a male fragrance i guess for some people they would consider it that but for me i absolutely love this scent this is a scent that i continuously repurchase first i had a smaller version and then i ended up getting the bigger bottle and i like to pull this out during fall because it's just that girl I love it and I like to wear this one as well sometimes I like to wear them together this one is by the fireplace this one is a little more fireplacey if that makes sense this jazz club one is more like you're in a jazz club there's dancing there is a fireplace but this one is like you're by the fireplace does that make sense there's a fireplace in the area you know with the jazz club it's not so prominent but this fireplace it smells like tobacco fireplace there's you know coffee there's like these warm situation like coffee shops kind of vibes this is what this gave me like burning wood and like there's like hot chocolate kind of situation. This is what I get from this. I still have a small bottle, 
um but i will definitely be getting the bigger bottle once this is over i do like the combination of these together i like to wear the by the fireplace with a lot of other perfumes that i have oriental tobacco i like to mix these two together baccarat 540 i just like this one it 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 does something it does something it just it gives what needs to be given okay that's just what i'm gonna say the next two i'm going to show you guys together because they're from the same house this okay so this is completely done like i have a couple of drops in here but if you guys know this is absolutely one of my favorite fragrances to date this is Maison Francaise Kirk Jean Gentle Fluidity. This one is a lot softer than everything else that I've shown you. Yes, this one is a little floral, I would say. There's depth, there's vanilla, there's floral, there's still a little woodsy kind of situation mix in here. But it's definitely more feminine than anything else i just showed you today if you are afraid of the darker like deeper scents that i just talked about this one will definitely suit you they do have a gentle fluidity silver as well not my cup of tea i don't really like it i like the depth of this gentle fluidity gold and the other one i'm going to show you is baccarat 540 you're very 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 familiar with this one the reason why i'm showing you this is because i like to pair these two together i think it just does something for me i like to wear my baccarat with jazz club i like to mix my baccarat with the by the fireplace I pretty much like to mix my Baccarat with a lot of other perfumes in my collection and it just does something to the scent. It gives people a whiff of the Baccarat while well, they're going to ask you, what are you wearing? But they're not sure because the other perfume is also hitting them. So it's like they don't know, what are you wearing? They smell it. They'll be like, I smell Baccarat, but what's that other thing? So that's why I like to mix my perfumes. Well, I like to mix these in particular and i think it gives a very nice feminine warm but not too overpowering scent and if that's what you're looking for these two are your girl this was definitely a very short video straight to the point if you haven't tried something here and you would like to try it i advise you to Check out Dossier and see if they have a more mm, affordable version of these perfumes because some of them are pretty pricey, okay? And Dossier has a lot of the luxury fragrances for less. The scents are spot on. Longevity, mm, 6 out of 10. And for some of them, 7 out of 10. But it's, it's amazing. It's truly amazing. You have to try it for yourself. Anyway, this is the end of the video. I want to thank you so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Share this video with your friends and family like I always say. Please do because it does help me a lot, you guys. We're almost at 1,000 subscribers. I am super, 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 super excited. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited. Anyway, I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.